What's up YouTube? Jeff the Style OG. And today's video is all about how to be successful with online dating. Now, dating has always been a complicated, frustrating, challenging, but hopefully ultimately rewarding process. But there's a few things you have to pay attention to that make online dating different. I've got five tips that I believe can help you and I'm gonna get right into it. First up, we gotta deal with first impressions, that main profile picture. It's the most important element when it comes to online dating. Just like you scrolling and swiping through, she's scrolling and swiping through. So you gotta catch her eye for her to even click on your message to begin with. Now here's a few things I don't want you to do. No bathroom selfies, not gonna work. No group shots. She doesn't have time in trying to figure out which one is you. But what I do want you to do, have some pictures that show you in your element enjoying things you like to do. Have pictures that you're looking off or looking away from the camera. It's been shown that women don't really like the direct smiling to the camera picture. The next important item on how to be successful with online dating, your profile itself. Now keep this in mind when you're writing your profile. I want you to try to express, not impress. Meaning express who you are. Let some of that cool off. If you're a geek or a nerd, be a geek or a nerd. Once she gets to know you, it's going to come out anyway. So be yourself. Talk about the things you like. Write it up. Have friends or family read it and see if it sounds like who you really are. If so, go ahead with it. Now, let's get into that all-important first message. When you've decided who you're going to try to get at, I want you to keep something in mind that I talk about when we're talking about clothing. That's tailoring. Tailor make your message for the young lady you're talking to. Don't do the cut, copy, and paste thing. She'll see right through that. Look at her profile. See something obscure or of interest to her and talk to her about that. If she's a very attractive woman, ease up on all the sexual or physical compliments. She's getting that all day. You're not going to stand out. Take a little time and study her profile. Get to know her a little better and tell her make your message for her. Okay, so now it's time to move into the phase I like to call, let's get our butts off the internet phase. Here's how this works. Build some rapport and trust with her first. Exchange emails for a few days, but no more than 15 to 25 emails. After that, suggest that you move to a more direct line of communication, text messaging, and phone calls. After a couple of days of that, hit her with the, look, we seem to have a few things in common, and I kind of like you. Let's meet up soon. If she seems to have a positive response for that, tell her, look, I'm open Monday or Wednesday. What's up with that? If she agrees, cool, move forward. If not, my man, you don't have an internet date partner. You got a pen pal. Okay, so now let's move on to that first date. It is called online dating after all. Now here's what I want you to do. After she's agreed to a time, you pick the place. You pick the activity. Women don't like indecisiveness. Make a decision and go with it. I'm going to suggest you don't pick concert, movies, anywhere that's real noisy. You want to go somewhere that's relatively quiet so you can talk and get to know each other a little better. Somewhere relaxed. And speaking of relaxed, this should be kind of easy for you. You've already built up a rapport, so it's almost like a second date. I want you to listen twice as much as you talk. It shouldn't be as difficult as a typical date. Okay, so there you have it. Five tips to help you be more successful with online dating. In the comments, let me know what's not worked or worked for you in the past when it comes to dating online. As always, if you enjoyed the video, hit that like button and share the video with a friend. I'm here every Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, and I hope you'll join me.